myself vasundhra sukla assistant professor in electrical electronic department of oriental college of technology bhopal in last lecture we have discussed common base configuration of bjt today we discuss common emitter configuration of bjt in common emitter configuration emitter terminal is taken as common terminal for both input and output of transistor the common emitter connection for both npn and pnp transistor is shown in figure as in common base configuration the emitter junction is forward bias and collector junction is reverse bias the flow of electron is controlled in same manner the input current is the base current and output current is the collector current in common emitter configuration current amplification factor is denoted by beta it is the ratio of change in collector current to change in base current now we discuss relation between beta and alpha beta equals to change in collector current to change in base current in common base configuration the amplification factor is alpha so it is ratio of change in collector current to change in emitter current the emitter current is equal to base current plus collector current this value is put in beta equation where delta ic divided by delta ib we find the delta ib value from equation ie equals to ib plus ic where we get delta ib equals to delta ie minus delta ic now we divide numerator and denominator both by delta ie beta equals to delta ic divided by delta ie whole divided by delta ie divided by delta i minus delta ic divided by delta i where delta ic by delta ie equals to alpha we put alpha in place of delta ic by delta i we get beta equals to alpha upon 1 minus alpha from our equation as alpha approaches 1 beta reaches infinity hence current gain in common emitter connection is very high this is the reason that's why in most transistor application we use common emitter configuration now we discuss collector current for common emitter configuration in common emitter configuration ib is the input current and ic is the output current ie equals to ib plus ic in common base configuration we get equation of collector current is ic equals to alpha e plus ic b in this equation we put the value of ie so we get equation alpha bracket of ib plus ic bracket close plus ic b ic value is shifted in left side so we get ic bracket of 1 minus alpha equals to alpha ib plus ic bo ic equals to alpha upon 1 minus alpha ib plus 1 upon 1 minus alpha into ic bo if base current is open if ib equals to 0 the collector emitter current with base open is iceo iceo equals to icbo divided by 1 minus alpha substitute this value in equation so we get ic equals to alpha upon 1 minus alpha ib plus iceo alpha upon 1 minus alpha is equal to beta so we get ic equals to beta ib plus iceo now we discuss characteristics of common emitter configuration this configuration provide good current gain and voltage gain the input resistance is the ratio of change in base emitter voltage to change in base current 
at constant collector emitter voltage. Output resistance is the ratio of change in collector emitter voltage to change in collector current at constant base current. Now we discuss input characteristics of common emitter configuration. The curve plotted between base current and base emitter voltage. The base current IB increases with increase in base emitter voltage. Input resistance of common emitter configuration is comparatively higher than that of common base configuration. Now we discuss output characteristics of common emitter configuration. The curve plotted between collector current and collector emitter voltage at constant IB base current. Output characteristics explain in three regions. Active region, saturation region and cutoff region. In active region, the collector current increases slightly as collector emitter current increases. The slope of cur curve is quite more than output characteristics of common base configuration. The output resistance of common base connection is more than that of common emitter connection. The value of collector current increases with the increase in collector emitter voltage at constant IB. The value of beta also increases. In saturation region, the collector current becomes independent and free from the input current that is IB. In cutoff region, IC is not equal to 0 when IB is 0. In next lecture, we discuss common collector configuration. Thank you.